One of the comments was, one of the messages that Kim said was, this will all go away, I promise. This is what they're betting on. There were times when I've even like glued it to my skin. Oh, and I'm like, wait, I'm not in this campaign. I don't know what's happening. But it seems like nobody wants to work these days. Which one are you, Kim? Or do you not know yet what you are, Kim? Are you still reevaluating your relationship with Balenciaga? Living alone the Balenciaga scandal, when it comes to last year, Kim Kardashian has become more problematic, scandalous, more hated, and of course, irrelevant. But do you know why? Of course, I'm here as usual to break it down for you. Okay, if you ask me, I will tell you over the last year, many things have been happening. And of course, Kim Kardashian is always known to put everything in contra of course she has been doing a lot of things which are out of line but when it comes to 2022 i will tell you many things were just out and of course she couldn't do anything about it and if i even look at her status right now if i look at her image i will tell you guys things are not very very okay we are going to be discussing a lot of scandals that led to her downfall and of course i'm here to give you all the tea thank you for everyone that has been really supporting us thank you for everyone that listens to me if you are always waiting to see what updates do i have for you every day you are really amazing and i really appreciate your support so they're betting on you all getting distracted by everything else that's going on in the world they'll continue to post and you'll forget about this and you'll move on but if we let this one go what does that say about us as a society first of all when it comes to the kardashians that is a way that they always survive certain situations maybe it's because of their strong pr system because if i look at their status of course they have a lot of money and of course they are always known to use what they have or even because of their strategic mom of course we are talking about chris jenner who is always using her influence we all know we have been seeing on most instances kim kardashian coming out and praising her mom and according to her she's like you know what there is nothing that my mom can't do for us of course she is very very connected and of course we can always reach these greater heights but 2022 brought out all the nasty and despicable behaviors of them all the main focus being kim kardashian her public image fell apart you know okay in the previous years many people always came out and complained about many things concerning kim kardashian but again it was not that serious if you ask me people talk about it on social media and of course at a certain point things just disappear and these people have a way of always taking advantage of such situations and of course over the years we have been seeing them being relevant and of course keeping their fame in ever since gaining fame that is 2007 kim kardashian has always maintained tight control of the press and public perception claiming that she is perfect and a good mom secondly claiming she works a lot and maintains her billionaire status and then proving to be better and the most relevant among her siblings among her siblings but her real characters got exposed and things changed abruptly and with cancel culture and everything yeah. happening, like I always want to take a beat. I want to make sure that I'm doing the right thing and it's the right thing to do. And I Let's start with the most important thing, the Balenciaga scandal, which mostly contributed to Kim's downfall. If I even look at the major things that happened, that was last year, and of course it really damaged her, that was the Balenciaga scandal. Okay, maybe she didn't see this coming because I would tell you, yes, she was connected to this fashion brand. She well knew what they were characterized of. Yes, she she knew that they were always doing the child exploitation but she went an extra mile to work for them and of course she always targeted herself and she was like you know what i have to work with balenciaga yes i want to be their main face i want to be relevant you know how she is always angry for fame and of course she can go an extra ball but addressing the issue after a week was way out of character and when she did what did she say because everyone was always waiting and they were like you know what what is this woman going to say this 
time round okay we know her she is money minded she is always after money and of course all the fame and all the influence that comes with working with such big brands but we expected her that kim is a mom and this time round she is going to do the right thing but after a week she came out on her social media platforms and she posted something concerning the balenciaga scandal remember it was consisting of child exploitation but according to her she was like you know what i was still checking through everything i was still being so sure i was still re-evaluating and of course seeing the damages and analyzing sit the situation okay this annoyed a lot of people because you can't tell me that you are still analyzing the situation come on what was there to analyze about everyone on social media was coming out with a lot of attention with a lot of focus concerning this issue and probably you are a mom you are a grown-up person you are the main face of balenciaga we expected you to do the right thing that was not even an excuse secondly exposing her illuminati and evil side which even includes her children that was total chaos being cancelled over there still we have been seeing a lot of rumors that you know what the kardashians are among the illuminati but it was just talked about but because of the balenciaga scandal i will tell you we go Got to see a different side of things and we got to witness that kim kardashian might be involved with the devil kanye came out and clarified about this kanye came out and warned her and he was like don't be tempted by the devil don't be influenced come out and speak out come out and do the right thing but even so she didn't come out until now we haven't seen anything later on coming out and making it seem she was defending balenciaga and shedding the father of her kids. People got mad at that. So it's like, I'm, they're mad if I don't speak out. They're mad if I do speak out and if I don't cancel. We all know about the recent interview where Kim Kardashian claimed that she was commenting about this and of course she was against cancel culture. This was out of line and I will tell you it wasn't a lot of things. According to her she was like, you know what, Balenciaga needs a second chance. Why are even people coming out and canceling it? Yes, I didn't come out and cancel the brand or even ban all their products but that is not the case. Okay, Kim Kardashian that was too far and that wasn't the situation because a lot of people have been coming out and you know shaking their heads they are scratching their elbows they're like what is this woman even telling us we all know they tried so much to escape the balenciaga situation but whichever way their time was just up so living alone the balenciaga scandal again way back in march kim kardashian lost the most respect while being interviewed on interview magazine i think this marked the beginning of her downfall she told the interviewer i have the best advice for women in business get up and work it seems like nobody wants to work these days okay if i look at work and kim kardashian i will tell you that sentence is not even complete it seems like nobody wants to work these days because you see everything on social media and you think oh it's just a lifestyle or oh it's like really quick and easy and you can just post something and it's not easy how dare you disrespect women like that just because you got everything on a silver spoon does kim kardashian really know what working hard means okay this created a lot of backlash on social media and if you ask me i would tell you that is not even called for because she came out and she was like you know what you women get up and work you are just lazing around but i will tell you many women are struggling out there they are putting all their efforts come on kim kardashian was born in a rich family and everything she has obviously it's just because she had a privileged life and secondly she has been taking care she has been taking advantage of most influential men influential men you know getting married to them strategizing a lot of things planning grown-up trips with her mom so she is the kind of a person who came back who came out in march and advised women to work and of course she was this she was disgrading them telling them that they are not doing enough i will tell you that was the beginning of everything again she received a lot of backlash on social media and to make matters worse she added fury to the situation she was seen lying and telling her sisters how they also struggled at a certain point which was a lie we all know her mom married a rich lawyer and basically this is where they got their money from at least everyone expected her 
her to come out and do the right thing that was apologizing but again she didn't do that again let's not forget how kim was branded delusional when she claimed everybody can achieve her looks okay this was also a major scandal that was in 2022 this was fueling body image insecurities we all know she does plastic surgery she undergoes expensive laser treatments insane photoshops and of course a lot of things so how can you even come out on social media and you're like you know what yes everyone can achieve my looks it's just very very simple come on what is even simple of course you can't come out and you can't come out and clarify all the things you have been doing to your body that includes endless surgeries that includes expensive lesser treatments and of course a lot of things so you coming out and telling all the young girls and telling all the mothers in the world that they can achieve your looks come on you're just creating a lot of insecurities it's like she was advising young girls to sell their bodies and get money to acquire her insane looks that was also a very very major backlash something else that degraded kim kardashian was her insane weight loss that was more vivid during the met gala if i even talk about the met gala and the weight loss and of course all the things that came along with that i clearly understand that you get my point this was among the biggest misstep of her career the society does not tolerate such insane weight loss and we all know how far she went everyone was like oh my god what is really happening to this woman because if you ask me i would tell you i even prefer the kim kardashian who had some bit of meat on her body you know some bit of curves and everything but again i even don't know where she gets all these insane ideas of losing all this excess weight even the irresponsible approach to losing this weight just so to fit in a dress was just really hilarious because according to her she came out and she was like you know what i managed to lose weight in just three weeks just to fit in this dress oh my god i even couldn't leave it okay she was frustrated she didn't even have anything and at a certain point she was even seen saying that even though i don't eat even though i didn't i don't breathe even though i don't do anything i don't care i just want to fit in a dress so according to me if you ask me that was very very scandalous and of course it really affected her image she was called out for triggering being a bad example by her fans and most fellow celebrities this also led to fans being less interested in their reality tv show because most scenes consisted of kim kardashian and her sister chloe bragging about how skinny they are i even remember a lot of complaints about this people came out endlessly and they were like you know what we are just tired of your reality reality tv show by the way this also brings the downfall of it because in the past years i will tell you if i look at the kardashians fame and power and relevancy their reality show contributed a lot but right now it is becoming less interesting and everyone is no longer you know watching it and of course giving it the attention like the previous days again their show has become very boring and money-minded to fans they show us what they want us to see they edit out what they don't want us to see what has become of them so all that ladies and gentlemen marks the downfall of kim kardashian she has done more harm than good and even her PR system couldn't do much this time round. Yes, they have money, they have relevancy. She has been coming out and of course telling us, you know what? I can take care of my image. I know how to play the cards. I know how to do the right thing. But if I look at last year and all the scandals she has been engaged in and if I look at at her image and status right now things are not adding up what do you even think about all the scandals i know you have a lot to tell me i'm waiting for you in the comment section don't forget to follow us if you haven't